Findings from the FDA's reports reveal that young adults, notably those between the ages of 15 and 34, have become the most prevalent consumers of alcohol. This demographic shift in alcohol consumption patterns has raised concerns about its long-term impact on public health, especially considering the well-documented association between excessive alcohol consumption and liver-related ailments. Liver disease, a critical health concern associated with heavy drinking, has now come into sharper focus due to the surge in alcohol consumption. Medical professionals and experts in the field spike in liver diseases such as alcoholic hepatitis, cirrhosis, and fatty liver disease. The liver can manage with one third of the liver, still do its functions very well. So this is a long-term drinking of alcohol that leads to a damage of the liver. There has to be a consistent binge. The medical community's concerns are not unfounded. Reports from various health facilities across the nation indicate a notable uptick in liver disease cases directly aligning with the observed surge in alcohol intake. Looking at the, the causes of uh, liver disease, especially liver cirrhosis, that for me I call it liver failure, and then the cancer of the liver. If you look at the, the median age at which uh, people in this country develop this alcohol-related liver disease, it's, it's around 46 years. Okay, and this disease is, is one also the major cause of death in this country. Overcrowded clinics and increased demand for liver-related treatments have become common occurrences further highlighting the implications of this escalating issue. We have a spectrum of, of disease that we call alcoholic liver disease. And people who drink excessive amount of alcohol, I mean beyond certain limit, the commonest one is what we call fatty liver disease, alcoholic fatty liver disease. And all patients, all people who drink excessive amount of alcohol, about 90 to 100 percent of them have this uh, alcoholic fatty liver disease. So sometimes the main thing is the financial support to manage them well, the willingness of them also to stop consuming the alcohol, and then the family support sometimes seems not to be there. Now, as the nation grapples with this challenge, it is clear that a multi-thronged approach, including healthcare professionals, policymakers, as well as civil society organizations, is vital to tackling both the surge in alcohol consumption as well as the powerful increase in liver disease. Imanol Somani, TV3 News, Accra.